appreciate it. I know someone is at home like, what is a doula? I hear this term used all the time. I'm not sure what that is. So break it down to us exactly what a doula is. And we're going to have some information posted there on your screen as well that you can follow along with at home. Well, a doula is a birth coach mm -hmm. for a mother-to-be. Um, and we provide uh, physical and emotional and educational support for mothers uh, before, during, and after birth. And at Labor and Delivery in Lexington Medical Center, we're actually one of the first of its kind in the Southeast. That's so. really good. Yeah. So when you talk about that support beforehand, walk me through some of the examples of how you can support a mother as a doula uh, before, before she actually gives birth. Well, we do things with like your birth plan. Uh, how you want to have your birth, uh, also help setting up, preparing for baby, um, and just all the other little things, questions, tips, tricks to help you along in preparing for birth and after birth as well. And also, what about uh, actually during the birthing experience? You have that as an option as well. Tell us more about that. And again, we have that information that can be pulled up on the screen there so people at home can follow along with. Yeah, absolutely. We are actually going to be being physical uh, labor and delivery techniques, uh, being calm the entire time, helping mom through the entire uh, plan with encouragement, maybe some position changes, uh, also with being able to having that person be more educated about their birth plan mm -hmm. and what that what they want as far as in delivery yeah and um, just really just making it a nice calm and rewarding experience for mother and baby I love that so. and you talked about like the breathing exercises right, the, right just remaining calm because obviously we know giving birth is it could be and is an overwhelming experience most definitely and then afterwards after the baby comes doulas can still assist the parents as well, Absolutely. even the dads who might need some help too. So walk us Absolutely. through that. Absolutely. We actually have a postpartum uh, doula care. Uh, that is for a uh, small fee. Mm -hmm. um, it's for a few hours uh, at a time and they help with household chores and maybe help picking up things around the house mm -hmm. and cooking and um, just with newborn care as well. So, um, but with the labor and delivery during the actual labor and delivery, that's a free service. Nice. And the postpartum is actually going to be a little small fee. So. And I saw uh, you also assist with breastfeeding as well. We do. Yeah. We do with breast helping with breastfeeding as well as um, with swaddling and everything else, getting you prepared. Alrighty, so speaking of swaddling, so if you are a new parent again or a reoccurring parent like me, I haven't had a baby in a couple of years, right? <laughs> and this right here, this, this whole process always had me so confused. So Chris is going to show us one of the services is right here live on Soda City Live uh, when it comes to being a doula, which includes the proper way, the safest way to swaddle your baby. So Chris, I'll let you get right to it. I'll let you walk me through it, okay? Okay, sure. You're gonna start with having this nice and diamond shape. You're gonna okay. take this top corner and bring that down. So Chris, does the type of blanket matter? It does. Okay. Um, you want a cotton blanket. Cotton blankets are gonna be a little more breathable for mm -hmm. baby. Baby doesn't get overheated. Right. And um, it's a little more comfortable. Uh, for them as well. So okay, so I take that. my top corner down. Take your top top corner down, mm -hmm. and then we're gonna put the baby right up in in that diamond shape. Okay. Here. Yeah. Okay. There we go. So and the baby's head needs to be how up far? above, right above, up that, above that fold. Okay. Right. And then you're gonna take that left corner mm -hmm. and bring that right up underneath the baby. Just tuck it up underneath. Tuck it them. in. Yeah. Do I do it tight? Uh, nice tight tuck. Okay. Nice tight tuck. Now, yeah. why the tightness? What is why swaddle a baby? Why is this important for the well, baby? It helps resemble what they felt in the womb. Mm -hmm. Nice, safe space, comfy, cozy, and it helps them to sleep a little bit better, calm them down a little bit more, and be able to just resemble being back in the tummy. So, okay. All okay. right. So after we do that first tuck, then we're gonna take this. Uh, the bottom corner. The bottom, and okay. And bring it up over the feet. There Alrighty. you go. And like this? That's over, yeah, just tuck it over just like that. Okay. Yeah. yeah. And then we're going to take this other corner, tuck it up underneath the baby. Just like back this? Back around the other way. Okay. There we See, go. See, I told this you way. I needed a refresher. It's <laughs> been a while. It has yes. been a while. And I better start practicing now. Okay. <laughs> so we do it this way. Yes. Okay. And then there you go. It's a nice. And then? A like nice swaddle. A little burrito, yes. Yes, a go. little burrito. Oh, I got to, like I said, I got to start practicing again. I'm getting all the baby vibes and feels. Chris Jones, thank you so much for thank coming for on, uh, representing Lexington Medical Center and the doula services offered there.